Welcome to the Prelude to Computer Science series. This is video number four, Essential Math, Number Systems. Our number system is called a base 10 positionally weighted number system. Notice that any number in our number system is formed by a sequence of digits and each digit is in the range of 0 to 9 inclusive. The value of the digit in the number depends on its position in the number. Our number system is positionally weighted. That means that the actual value of a digit depends on the position of the digit in the number. Take for example the number 2092. The 2 on the left means 2000, while the 2 on the right means just 2. We can expand base 10 numbers. Take for example 2092 that we saw on the last slide. Note that there is an implied decimal point after the last two. We say it's implied because it's assumed to be there even when it's not printed. Now this means two one thousands, zero one hundreds, nine tens, and two ones. So we're going to expand it backwards and the, f the last two means two times ten to the power of zero. Ten to the power of zero is just one, so that's two ones or two times one. The nine means nine tens or nine times ten to the power of one. Remember that ten to the power of one is just ten. So the nine expands to nine times ten to the power of one. The zero means zero one hundreds. That is zero times ten squared, ten squared being a hundred. Finally, we come to the first two, the first two on the left, which means two one thousands. Another way of writing one thousand is ten cubed, or ten to the power of three. So our total expansion is two one thousands plus zero one hundredths plus nine tens, plus two ones. We expand a base ten number by multiplying each digit by a power of ten. The power of ten that is used for each digit is uniquely determined by the position of that digit in the number with respect to the implied decimal point. The digit immediately to the left of the decimal point is multiplied by the zeroth power of 10, that is 10 to the power of 0. And then we increase the power of 10 by 1 for every digit we move to the left. We can expand decimal numbers too. Uh, for example, say we want to expand 20.92. This is 2 times 10 to the 1 plus 0 times 10 to the 0 plus 9 times 10 to the minus 1 plus 2 times 10 to the minus 2. Uh, what this means is 2 tens, 0 ones, 9 one tenths, and 2 one hundredths. Notice that the uh, digit immediately to the right of the decimal point has an exponent of minus 1 and as we move to the right of the decimal point every position that we move the exponent is decreased by one becoming more and more negative as we progress to summarize our base 10 number system base 10 uses all the digits between 0 and 9 Notice that there is no single digit for 10. Instead, we write it with two digits, 1 and 0. It's a positionally weighted number system. This means that the first digit to the left of the decimal point is weighted with the zeroth power of 10. 10 to the power of 0 is 1. And therefore, the first digit to the left of the decimal point is saying how many 1s there are. Moving left, each position increases its weight by one power of 10. Moving right, each position decreases its weight by one power of 10. That is our review of essential math. In our
our next video we'll expand our current knowledge into understanding the number system that is used by computers.